Hey, how's it going, folks? Well, the WWE has fined Lars Sullivan $100,000 for the remarks he did make in the past on message boards. And Lars Sullivan recently apologized for these remarks, but then sponsors started getting emails from fans and whatnot. And one sponsor, Mars Wrigley, actually said they were in contact with the WWE regarding this. And today, WWE issued a statement to numerous outlets, including Forbes, Newsweek, Fightful, PW Insider, that did state, WWE supports of culture of inclusion, regardless of gender, race, religion, or sexual orientation. And we are committed to embracing all individuals as demonstrated by our diversity of our employees, performers and fans worldwide. Dylan Miley, AKA Lars Sullivan will be fined $100,000 and required to complete sensitivity training for offensive commentary uncovered from his past. WWE will also facilitate meetings for Dylan with community organizations to foster further discussions around the power of social media and the impact of your words. And Newsweek did also follow up with the WWE and asked them if Dylan, aka Lars Sullivan, will continue to work on television as well as house shows as he does undergo sensitivity training. And the WWE did state that he will continue to work live events as well as television as he does do sensitivity training. And obviously this is WWE's way of, I'm not gonna say shut up some of the sponsors, but they're trying to save face here, I believe, due to a lot of the backlash that has come forth with these remarks. It has made mainstream media at this point when Newsweek and Forbes and a lot of other publications are reporting on it. WWE obviously needed to do something and they have now fined Lars Sullivan. That being said, your thoughts as always, drop them in the comments below. And don't forget to DDT that like button and subscribe, join the notification squad to be notified of new videos and have a great day.